Right, hopefully you'll all find that I'm uh, back again. It keeps saying that it's either a copyright claim or that someone's complained. So if someone is complaining out there... <laughs> yeah, it's saying that something about a copyright complaint or that someone is com currently complaining about me. So that's lovely. Oh, this is signed exquisite. Yes, as I was saying, it's making rainbows, so that means that it's crystal. So that's lovely. We've got a little enamel um, seahorse. Yeah, so if I do keep going, um, if I do go again, it means that someone is being a bugger and reporting me for something. Um, Barry M facing sh body shimmer. I don't know. Some people just don't like me though, and you know, that's fine. Red herring. Red herring is an okay brand. Right. I've got lots of these like shell things. I might just do a lot of them together, or again in my um, you know, holiday lots. Some is that Gokwan stuff, turquoise and wood bits, some more of these really cool leather printed ones, I like them, I do like them, that is something that I would be interested in selling, you see, like, if they're just weird and in, Barmouth is in Wales, really, I have so never heard of it, that's terrible, isn't it? Yes, Heather, send those hexy vibes to whoever it is that's uh, telling tales on me. They're obviously the... Lots of bits and bits and bits. You're not silver. I hate to give things complexes, though, by going like, you're not silver. And it's like, but I want it to be silver, but you're not. Cheryl Green, fine artist. Fine artist and textile artist. Oh, so this is a handmade little dobby. That's cool. So Barmouth is on the Welsh coast. Yep, yeah, totally never heard of it. That's so bad of me. <laughs> uh, nice little bracelets. Some more turquoise stuff for my turquoise lot. Right. A little box with some silver and gold tone earrings. No, not signed or anything, but they're very nice. See, like little half hoop rope things, probably uh, 90s maybe. You look like a mess of broken bits. Oh my god. Okay, so you know that tribal necklace from earlier? There's loads of beads of them. How cool is that? Wow. It's like yin yangs and sun and moon and star and face. Oh my god. These are brilliant. Wow. Aw, thank you, Carol. These are amazing. Look at that sun and then moon and star on the other side. They're awesome. I love them, they're staying out. That's very cool. Um, oh, hello, hello. Right. Oh, if only you were clippy. Bugger. Right, if that was a clip there, that would attach to that and be a very cool, um, what do you mean, um, what for? Are you, are you asking me something? Oh, hello, Josh. That's cool. Oh, it's not quite a choker. It's a shame that's not clippy, but that potentially um, a bit of, I 
think it's, is it Turkish? Um, what for take three? Um, I'm not quite understood. Yeah, it did, it did stop again, Andrea. Um, oh, do you mean why did it stop again? What for? Right, it's either someone, because it's saying copyright thing, but there's no copyright claims in here. There's no music playing or anything. Or someone is making a complaint. But anyway, so that could be Turkish trench art, I think. Possibly. But it's a shame there's no clippy thing in its head, because I've had one of them before. There's a clippy thing in its head and it hangs onto his tail. But that's very cool and unusual. So that's staying out. I only know that because I've sold one before. <laughs> Otherwise, obviously, I wouldn't have known that. A little brass looks like a belt buckle thing. That's nice. I like that. You kind of see the things that I like, and you're probably seeing things that you like that I'm putting in there. And it's not because I don't think it's any good. It's just, you know, not me. I like weird and unusual stuff oh okay why ccc yorkshire county cricket club mother she'll be happy with this i've got one for you sorry i have to call the room for this one mother oh she's gone i got a present for you what is it you like it? Oh, why CCC? Oh, what's that? So that's York County Cricket Club. Oh, oh brilliant! Yeah. Oh. oh. Hey. Yay! <laughs> so, mummy gets something too. Lovely. Um, it might not be the content. It might be the person. <laughs> Oh, that's annoying, um, Ashley. Lovely green bangles. Oh, that's nice. I like you. Strap on that watch there. So I'll do a watch lot, which will go up on Sunday, probably. Anything else in there? That's a nice, heavy necklace. Ugh. Let's go. Right. There's some makeup bits in here, which is a bit odd. Some number seven, Stay Perfect Eyeshadow. Some Avon. Oh, that hasn't been used. Handy black and white palette there. Any jam being made soon? It's not quite ready yet, because the gooseberries um, and the red currants are only just in the making. I've got some men's weird jewellery. Um, who needs to get their bumming gear? Ah, just chill out. Chill out here. Right, some more. There's loads of these leather things and I really love them. They're super cool. That will go into my turquoise and coral lot. That's lovely. That might actually... Right. That is certainly a lovely bead there. Probably made to look like coral. Really heavy. That is super nice. That is staying out. Oh, we got a nice little Celtic cross. Oh, again, resin made to look like wood. I like that. Yeah, I get, I get the feeling that they're gonna pick up soon, Ashley. Ew. Okay, I think we got our first little bit of gold. Possibly. Where is my loop? Where is my loop? Right. I have my little kit. Okay. First of all, first test, right? Is it magnetic? It's not magnetic. Okay. So that's always your first test. Well, not always, but you know. If you can. And then loop de loop. 
because I think I saw a mark on there. I think that says nine carat on there. Yep. We've got gold. And that could be citrine on there. But that is a lovely earring, isn't it? That's going on there. So, yay, gold. Let's hope the other one is in here. Oh. Guess what we found? Guess what we found? Guess what we found? Can you guess? Can you guess? Can you guess what we found? Let me just pop some of these in here. Correct, Lisa. It's our now. Yay. And he's also stamped 925. So he's a little silver now. So that's great. I hope he has a little friend. That's super pretty. You want to be silver, but you're not. But that is nice. I might just like find a little chain. Because that's quite pretty. Oh, we have got... Is that a nail thing? Like a scoopy nail thing? I don't know. Right, I do, honestly, the, going through... Tiny little bits is my absolute favourite. That's a nice little bit of brass. So that's a lovely brass bangle. I know the best kind of nowel. Interesting brass bangle that. Really hope that the owl and the citrine have little friends in here because that would be lush. I do see some little more vintage earrings, which is good. We've got a little pentagram. No, that's not a pentagram if it's six sides, is it? Obviously, otherwise it wouldn't be called a pentagram. Martin James London Boutique Collection. I'll keep that baggy aside. It's a nice one. Right, I cannot see... The friends for those earrings in here. I'm going to test that silver, you know. Because that might be silver with like a bone ivory handle. That's interesting. We'll keep that aside. Yeah. They're not in there. But that's okay, because the worst comes to the worst, I've still got my nowl, which is good. I'm glad we got the nowl, I'm glad that he's there, because it just wouldn't be the same without him, you know. Oh, right. And there's some more boxes in here. I have definitely at least lost one pair of scissors whilst doing this, so I don't know what box they've gone into or anything. <laughs> oh, we've got lots of lovely painted trade style beads in here. You... Oh yeah, I'd love a coffee actually. So these are some really fun beads that will obviously go into a bead lot. But look at them lovely painted wooden beads. They're rather fab. Um, it is just ivory that's a no-no. You can sell ivory within the UK as long as it's dated pre-1947. Yeah. Some more fab beads. That, that'll be from a vintage necklace, that. That's a shame that's broken, but that'll be some fun beads for people to play with. So you want it to be silver, but you're not. That's a shame. A nice little set in there. Oh, right. So. This 
is ivory, <laughs> I think. Um, it has got carved elephant on there. It's very irregular on the back. There you can see grain and stuff, but the grain is not um, like basically that's ivory, I think. Do you want to see, man? I think I got some ivory. I mean, I can't tell because I've got gloves on, but what do you reckon? Oh, you reckon it's bone? Yeah, because there's a hole in it. Well, would ivory not have holes in it? You can drill ivory. Yeah, it's use a regular hole. And it's soft to be, to be found in animal bone. Oh, right, okay. But that doesn't say, you know. This is probably wanting to be ivory, but don't think so. No, it's bone. Okay, there you go. Listen to mummy. I mainly do listen to mummy. Mostly. Is is so fine? Yes. Yeah, it's... Rarely. That's quite nice. Um, I do quite well on these. Like chunky things, chunky or vintage. Bold men. What's that? For bald men. For bald men? Or bald. Bald men. Bald men. Chinkops. Oh, yeah. But they're in fashion, that, um, that kind of look. Yeah. Is it? Oh, that's a nice bangle. Some, like, twisted metal brass. I like that. Got some vintage, what are they called? Crystalina Nickel Free Clip-Ons. $41.95. Fuck the fuck off. Strange Maybe that's like abroad somewhere. That's bizarre. They're staying out. Right, I've got to see a little lipstick case. That's nice. Lovely little lipstick case and mirror in there. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. Yeah. That's pastimes, isn't it? Probably. With that enamel roses. Well, that's so pretty. That'll stay out. Oh, look at these earrings. Look at that. That's a clip on. That's fun. We like that. I hope there's got a friend. Oh, you're a nice earring too. Why don't you have a friend? That's a lovely earring. That's super nice. You can you can stay aside. And how are you working? Right, you're very tangled. I'm I'm not dealing with you right now. Um, another vint. Oh, pair of vintage earrings. Lovely. It's just plastic beaded, but they're rather camp and kitsch. Nineteen. I don't know. 80s to look like 50s, I think. Thank you, Mummy. Has it got flavour in? Yeah. Thank you. Very calm. Mmm. Um, lovely shoe clip. 1980s velvet shoe clip there. I hope you'll have a friend at some point. Hair things. Oh, that's lovely. Look at that again, like cut glass crystal. Um, you're hoping, Daz. <laughs> um, oh, that's cute. Some like abalone on there. That's quite nice. Possibly 1970s. Oh, <gasps> you're pretty. And then black glass. Um, that will go like there on your collar. That's nice, I like that. You can stay out. You can stay and play. Little bit, oh, and we've got, oh, that's super cute. Are you faux pill? Yeah, you are. Some grey faux pills with a lovely little clasp there. That can stay out. And that's a nice little box as well, isn't it? That's lovely. Okay, let's get stuck into some more. 
100 euro coins. Zembo dividers essential. Oh, hello. You're broken, don't be broken. It's okay, I can fix mm. you. Shame you've got no clasp though. Nice little bezel set, gems in there and faux pearl. It's broken, but I'm going to keep it aside to fix it because I like it. Um, you want it to be silver, but you're not. Um, you want to be vintage, but you're not. But it's still a nice little set of faux pearls. That's a banging big set of beads there. Some hair stuff, some more of them leather things. They're crazy and they're everywhere, but I like them, so that's okay. That's a lovely little bracelet. I, mean, I don't normally like stretchy bracelets and I would never wear something like that, but the beads are really nice. So don't always discount stretchy stuff. There's me as I throw them in there, but you know. That's super pretty. That looks handmade. It's got little bits of uh, quartz crystal and some handmade little female flowers in there that's nice a little button I like that a vintage earring a broken ring but again for a craft lot someone will want to make something from that I spice some silver um oh you're cute a little puss in boots enamel pin I like you right we've got some silver I reckon. Very, very tarnished, but definitely silver. Can you see how black that is? Look at how black that is. These have not been in a good place. But, get one of these. Are you all still there or am I on my own? By the way, I should put it on my touch. Here we go. Right, got a polishing cloth. Let's see if that does anything. I mean, it might just be that they want it to, you know. Oh, that's okay then. It's just I thought that my chat had stopped. <sighs> okay. Did you, did you, so remember the, the before then, okay. In fact, I'll show the two up together. Just with like a little light polishing. Can you see the difference? But they are nice, aren't they? Lovely Celtic knot. Hapus, Hapus Yarn. So they're pretty. They're going on my special place. On the tree. <laughs> Oh, well, that's very nice. I know, 64. That's crazy. Um, painted things. Oh, hello. What are you? You are a scarf ring. That's quite nice. On its original little display things we never used. It's good that there has been some stuff like, in there for me so that I'm like, oh, I'm happy. I got my little bits and now people can have their little bits. You're not gold, you want it to be, but you're not, and it's a shame. It's a little cross, but it's broken and it's not gold, but that's okay. A lovely belt buckle. It's glass. Oh, yeah, it's going to lie down in a darkened room, definitely. Lovely glass belt buckle, that's beautiful. You can stay out. You can stay out and play. And we've got a sparkly necklace, which looks Art Deco, but it's probably not. But that is quite pretty, isn't it? That's nice. So you can stay out and play. Oh, the obligatory heart pin. Oh, there's even a bit of that purple. Yay. So I'll add you in so I can fix that. There's some nice things there, some lovely uh, bits of glass, quartz, a weird little ring, you can stay aside. 
Um, and we've got what looks like a mother of pearl pendant. So I've got a little pile of silver, um, silver tone chains. Okay. I wanted to add that to that, but that's quite a nice pendant. You can stay out and play. And we've got the same a little bit of amethyst as well. So you're staying out to play. Empty box, an empty box. I'm all right with that there. Why have I got in my head? We go together like a school council pin. I like that. Another ring. Right, I spy some freedom at top shop. Wild fable. That's a lot of earrings on there. A lot of earrings. Nickel free, sixteen dollar. Got some Buckingham. I always find some Buckingham as well. Buckingham stuff is all right. Doesn't go for loads. Johnny loves Rosie. That's a good one. That's a little kind of cultish brand, isn't it? Oh, we've got a match to that lapis lazuli silver earring. So that's fab. That gives me hope for our little golden screen one. There's some lovely beads on there. Look at that. That's fun. Some little hair thing. Little butterfly thing. Right, Johnny loves Rosie, little charm bracelet. Oh, there's some proper cute little charms on there. Look at that little enamel house. That is lovely. And a little enamel person and then a little like cameo thing. That's super cute. I like Johnny loves Rosie stuff. So you can stay out and play. It's still on hold, that proper sucks. Hmm. Right, we've got some rings and bits, and I want to get to you. Well, you're not signed, but you are a super cute, tiny little bunch of roses. That's nice. You're staying out. And what are you? You're a bit mad and bonkers. You are signed Avon. So that's quite a nice piece. Peace. I like that. It's kind of Indian inspired, isn't it? That's Avon. Avon does have a following and fair play to it. Sometimes it's quite staid, but it's like it's, it's dependable jewelry, you know? Players accessories. Modest, I think you would call Avon most of the time. Modest jewellery. Yeah, it's nice, nice, just a good, good bracelet, you know? I think that's what Avon are really good at, is just like, decent things. That's a fab little sparky bangle. Next beastly bangle, that. I think they were part of the set. Little ring, keep you aside. It's more of that, um... How like turquoise stuff. And some little bits. Not terribly exciting, I'll keep you aside. Oh, what's this? Right, the Camping Club of Great Britain and Ireland, 1978 Fifth Christmas Meetup. <laughs> I love random shit like this. Oh, bye bye Carrie. For popping in. That I sound like Peter Ray then. Oh, look at that. I know, completely random, isn't it? That's why I like shit like this. Oh, we've got Fresh Air Leeds DA newsletter. That's unusual, isn't it? I, I, they're cool. They're staying out. They're staying out. Oh. Got a lovely little tin. 
Right, Cremona Dairy Cream Coffee Toffee made with pure cream. Okay, there's nothing truly exciting in here. It's got we've got some little buttons, poppers, um, and a very old Gillette razor blade. So I'm glad I was wearing gloves for that one. But that's such a cute little tin for that. That's nice. Keep it stay in play. Uh, oh, right. What a thrilling meetup they must have had for the fifth time. Um, oh, that's cute. It's a little, like, add-on Peter Pan collar thing from New Look. Avon Cosmetics. See you. No, you're not silver. You're still pretty. That's nice. Little stretch abalone. You can stay in play. That's lovely. Like little charm thing with like your little mini fury in there. That's super pretty. It is going to take me the longest time to go through all this, so you better not be having a busy afternoon. Some like fun barbed wire bead there. So much lovely stuff for crafters in here as well. A solo vintage earring, come here. That's quite a nice little flower earring. Even solo earrings I would still sell. Oh, hello. Hello, pretty, come to me. Are you broken? Well, you are a little bit broken and then you're all caught up there. Oh, come out, come on. Can I just give you a little? No, you're wedged in there. Well, she's got an earring wedged in it, but we've got a lovely bone china brooch there. Here's our maker, Cold Brook China. And that is somehow hooked on a petal in there. Firmly wedged. So I'll have to coax that out at some point. Um, some more toe dividers. I don't know what they're trying to tell me. Oh, we had buckle like that earlier that's what it is then it's like a hair barrette does this say silver plated giftware i'll keep that out in case we find <gasps> hello you're nice i like you that's a lovely stretch bracelet there that almost looks like a jackie is jackie brazil almost but i like that that's unusual Sobriel, Jackie Brazil. Right, you're a vintage necklace. Come here. Yes, you are. Again, bezel set. Oh, hey, Donna. You're right. I'm going through um, approximately 90 kilos of jewellery because I'm crazy like that. Right, you're stainless steel and you're very tight, but you're a nice chunky bracelet. Nice. A uh, scarf ring. More bangles. What do you say? Coral craft mini clip, but there's only one. Oh, only one. Hopefully, we'll find your friend. Coral craft is good. I really want to find that other owl and that citrine earring. Because they're lovely. And I'm so glad I'm finding nice vintage bits for me as well. Not meaning to be too selfish, but you know. I want bits for me. You're a vintage earring, but you're gold plated. That's a nice bangle. An H. Samuel box. That's a nice bangle. Vintage earring. I know, 90 kilos. I've only done 20 of the smaller boxes so far. Right, I like little baggies like this. That's, that's a very pretty little bracelet, little bangle, hinged bangle, that's nice. Another one. 
And what have we got here? Some unusual little clip-on bits. That's a bit of sterling silver there. So got a little silver with um, a little mother of pearl type dangle. Still some unusual earrings. Any bits for me? Oh, so we've got we've got a pair of those, like with the silver and stuff. That's a nice little pair there of clip ons to keep you aside. That's unusual. I'm not sure if I like them or in shield bits. And then they're for a broken jewelry lock because there's a stone missing, but they're quite art deco. I like them. So they can go in there. Ooh. Right, we've got a little padded bag of stuff. Oh, it really is heaven, honestly. <gasps> right, a little apple, the best teacher. That's so cute. <laughs> a little, oh, uh, so that'll go in a broken jewelry lot, vintage jewelry lot, but that's nice for a craft for that. We've got a little baggy of things here I'll have a look at in a sec. A nice little, oh you're lovely. This is a 70s brutalist modernist bracelet, probably gold plated but that, look at that texture on there. Isn't that lovely? That is gorgeous. Really like that, shame there's no maker's mark on it. But that's super nice. You can stay. Um, what are you? You don't have a brand, but you're quite. Oh, you're broken. That's a shame. I sold this necklace before. This is quite a nice one. Again, like just a flat. Like, I'm not sure what you call this link, but that's quite nice. Um, wow, we've got a heavy chain with lots of crosses on. That's quite funky. That's cool. Oh, honestly, I'm in heaven right now. And to think that, like, this is just me roughly going through it. I'll go through it again. Oh, it's a shame we got a broken cross here. Um, a little vintage scarf ring. Oh, um, uh, St. Friscus. St. St. Francis of Assisi thing, <laughs> quite a random one, um, and brooch, but it's very broken, so that'll go in a broken vintage jewellery. This is fab, Juicy Couture. <laughs> this is fab, and by fab I mean it's disgusting, and it's broken, which is a shame, but it's missing a gem on the front. But that's kind of fun, it must do something but I don't know what. Another faux pearl necklace, which is quite nice. Uh, you've got a silver bill. I'm gonna test you for silver. Don't you think with Baltic Amber in there? There's a little bit of Baltic Amber missing on this side, but I'm gonna test you for silver in there because I reckon you are. Oh, some rather fab new wave earrings. I like them. I hope you're all noting down my uh, keywords as well. Okay, what is it? What brand has got like a pheasant in a top hat? Is that Jack Wills? I think. <laughs> We'd also have to cut you up into boxes as well. Yeah, I think that's Jack Wills, isn't it? Um, oh, you're broken, that's a shame. Yeah, I will literally have to go through all of this again and divide up like the broken stuff and the kid stuff and a tiny little sterling silver St. Christopher. How tiny is that? Look. Tiny, smidgy tiny. 
Yeah, so I'll have to sort through all this proper. But I'm glad that obviously they've got my bits from there, which means other people can have their bits as well. If this was all a pile of cat, I'd be going like, no, you can't have it because I've got to scrape my money back. But I know I'm okay, so you're all going to be okay too, if you want it, obviously. Um, got a nice little one in here. Um, you're a cute earring, but do you mind it off? Right. I've got a pair of vintage faux pearl earrings in there, which I will keep aside for a lot. And then this nice tiger's eye ring as well. And are you crystal? Are you making rainbows? Oh, well, I might keep you aside. You're kind of pretty. Some vintage clip-ons. Now you want to be silver, but you're not. Oh, there's the other one to that one. So we've got a nice little pair. So we decided you went silver, but are you? No, you're not. And the rest of them are definitely not. I'll put you back in that little baggie. So that you don't get confused and lose your friends because we don't want them to lose their friends they came here all the way together and you know they've got to stay together for a while because i'm weird like that oh that's a nice bangle with all the waves on it i like that you can stay out bit of pink leopard print um <laughs> Yes, you go into the important things. This is not important right now. Oh, we've got a mate to that. That fish and crown enamel earring from earlier. So that's good news. Um, and we've got another one of those resin crosses. So that's nice. Um, still going live? Yeah. Do you know what? Let's just go for it, innit? Let's just go for it. Right, we have got a T or a J. It's a J. Again, you want it to be silver, but you're not. A brand new bag tag thingy in the bob. You're a nice earring. You're silver. You can stay. That's pretty. I hope we find your friend. Oh! Yay! We've got a little Leo. I'm a Leo. You can stay out. I like you. Nice red beads there. How's it going, Mummy? Bye. Where do you want it? I've already put them together. They're outside charging. Yeah, where do you want them? Oh, in the wisteria? Got Not wisteria, clematis. Cl thing is, it gets tangled up in there and then you can't get them. Oh, well and then around the... The back of... Do you want to go back of the wall? Behind? Yeah, that's where I mean, the behind seat. the seats, yeah. yeah. That see would be cool. Do you know how long it is? No. Mum treated me to some um, dragonfly garden lights to put around the bench that would be nice spare, got spare dragonflies as well. yeah there's two spare dragonflies mm. wow these are really tarnished as well but i think these are silver 24. There must be something like 24 hooks then. just some silver hoops they're very well tarnished but you're going over there a little snowflake. Some more cute little rings. That's a nice one. Looks like a little oil slick. Right. Little bits at the bottom of the bag. 
Oh yeah, I'm I'm very happy, Darren. Thank you very much. Another nice bangle there. Okay, obligatory poppy as well. Ooh, some lovely uh, yellow plastic clip-ons. There, fab, you're staying out. Let's put on there. We've got a mink to use, some pink clip-ons. There, quite tarnished off. That's a cute little brush. It's, um, unfortunately, its plating is coming off. So that'll go into a vintage broken lot for someone to make something out of. But that's rather lovely. Um, are you silver? No, you're not. Oh, you're gorgeous. Okay, a little enamel leaf with a little enamel dragonfly. But the dragonfly comes off because it's a pin and you can wear it for it. How cute is that? Love you. You're nice. Unusual. Oh, we got a little turtle. We got a little turtle. That'll stay out for my friend Mia. Lots of little rings. Some more number seven makeup. Oh, that's a little purple shimmery thing. I won't use it, obviously. You're a nice earring. You can stay out. Bits of watches. Key rings. Oh, that's a lovely little plastic hair barrette. Find any bee jewellery. Okay, so I'm looking out for bees and dashens. And owls, obviously. More of these things. More of these things. Little brass uh, thimble. Got a little pin here with a heart on it. Some Rimmel lipstick. A pair of vintage plastic earrings. We've got a little bit of amber. A little amber pendant there. Can stay. Um, that looks like a little bit of quartz. Very tarnished ring there. Made in France. So that's a vintage little hair clip. I'll keep that out for a while just because it's. And there's another one. Just because it's, you know, nostalgia maybe. I don't know. Sorry, I'm completely... Oh, hey, Kirsten. You've missed a lot, but don't worry. I've still got a lot to go through. So you can stay with me all day if you want. Um, yeah, I don't think there's anything way more interesting in the, the littles in here. It's like broken beads and single earrings and a marble and some lipstick. So <gasps> that's that box done. Mm. Yes, it's your daughter's birthday, isn't it? You've been having fun. Mm -hmm. Right, we're going to do another box, aren't we? Yes, we are. I am. Um, Obviously running out of space, so we're going to go right back here, and you're going to follow it. And we're going to grab you. What do you reckon, this one? I think so. I don't know what I just trod on then. Um, bean oh, and hello, stall. Sorry, um, Helen Chamberlain. Fucking that's nice, nice thing to say. <laughs> ah, right, okay. 
I think in here we're going to have the... Um... Oh, am I blurry now? Am I? Is anyone else saying I'm blurry? I'm looking at my stream on there and I look, well, as okay as I can. Right, jewellery stands. We've got jewellery stands. So, they're a little bit, um, you know, amused. But, yeah, we've got, that's useful. So, like, earrings and necklace. You put the, the earrings in there. We've got a few of them, it looks like. Some weird blow-up thing. I don't know what that is. Um... I mean, they they are all quite used, but they're all right though. You know, I'm sure they can clean them up. Do you use a certain courier for collection from auctions? This is the first time I've ever done it, and the other people helped me do it. So I think they use DPD. The bottle kiln. <gasps> That's pretty. Look at that. That's glass. That's really nice. Ooh, I like that. A nice box too. That is super cute, isn't it? You can stay. I know it's gorgeous, isn't it? Gorgeous. <laughs> Right, there's this, and then I just tipped it everywhere. <laughs> I don't think there's much content in it, though. Oh, I just spied the most beautiful earring. Napier. That has a lovely screw-back clip-on earring. I hope it has a friend. I love that. Right, there's some more boxes. Oh, right, anyone in December? That's pretty. We've got very messed up green body henna soap. Okay. Unusual. Oh, this has got lots of little bits in it. I spy vintage in there, so we'll go through that in a bit. Pre mark pearls. Some bangles, there's a nice orange bangle and a lovely vintage twisted plastic turquoise colour one. There's some little bits in here, there's some Claire's accessories. Earrings in a little box, there's a few of these hexagon box. Right, this bit looks, oh my word, what on earth are you? You vile, vile creature. That is potentially the most disgusting thing I've ever seen. I'm sorry if you're looking at it going like, oh, I love that. But that is horrid. Horrid. Yes, um, Sucru. Sucru too. Yeah. Isn't that just grim? I know, that's just gross, isn't it? I might try and sell it. It's disgusting. I hate it. I hate it beyond passion. As me. Look, you're just on camera there, look. Ask me, you're there. Look, look at you. She's like, yeah, whatever. I just want to see if you've got any treats. Um, we've got a tiny little calculator. Oh no, that's a, that's a credit card sign-in thingy, isn't it? I don't know. I wonder if that's a saleable thing. Um, we've got lots of key rings. One that's flashing, girls rule. I collect disgusting dolphin ornaments. Of course you do. Of course you do, Charles. I'll send, send you that and I shall also send you this um, Weight Watchers, Orlando, Florida, the flashing girls rule. So, uh, 
Yeah, you treat yourself there, yeah? Yeah, this is just all key rings. Aquarius. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Who wanted a dashand? Hands up, who wanted a dashand? Dachshund. I think this is one. It's certainly a little puppy on a string. Oh, with a little bone. Is Nia still there? Look, the little puppy. And it's articulated too. I think it's pewter and his little legs move. Is that the kind of puppy you want? That's cute. Oh, Karen, it's grim. It's grim. So would, would you like that, Nia? If so, message me your address and I'll send it yeah. Okay? Sausage dog. <laughs> That's cute. I'll keep him inside. There you go. You asked him for this. And um, there's a sperm. Does anybody want a sperm? Shelly, you might be getting that. Bit of sperm. That's nice, isn't it? That's fun. Oh, I spy a kitty cat. Oh, hello. You're nice. No, Sue, honestly, like, I've done three boxes. I've still got those two massive boxes and all this to go. Like, there's, there's plenty. I'm gonna go until everybody starts getting bored, okay? I mean, they might already be bored. Right, let's have a look in this little case. I think I poured out half the contents and there's nothing that I can see there on top that's interesting. Underneath, we have got a Monet single earring. Um, Another Monet single earring. Marks and Spencers. Nothing. Nothing exciting in there. But cute little case. I could do a little dog lot. Oh, shouldn't have done that. Um. Ooh. We've got a lush demon in the dark soap. Okay. Um, so did you need all this stock or is it a reaction against your no put <sighs> a bit of both to be honest I haven't bought stock for ages and that definitely obviously scratches the itch but then this was also just one of those things that I will give myself permission to spend because it was such a I'm not going to have this opportunity again for a while and I had to make the decision there and then and I think everyone would know, really. This is the kind of thing that, not just, oh, I can't say no to it. It's the kind of thing that you shouldn't say no to it. If you are a reseller, you shouldn't say no to this. Okay. I think. Okay, so in that little baggie of stuff, we've got a little vintage, is it Hollywood? Yeah. Hollywood brooch um oh so on the scale how excited when you oh my god sue so i've been excited since i said yes to it yesterday and i was like is it here yeah is it here that's a nice little crystal necklace am i putting things back in there or am i chucking over there yeah there was nothing too exciting in there um I really want to get this out. Oh, okay. Here we go, I did it. Um, yes, it was approximately 100 <laughs> on the Excite. Ooh. So I've got some nice stands. They're just a little bit like they need a good, you know. Yeah, exactly. It is, it is therapeutic going through stuff. And West one. And, you know, now people can have some nice lots off me as well so it's handy for them 
Um, is there anything here? You look silver, but you're not. You lying little fuck. <laughs> uh, got any earring stands? Um, let me see. Is it Raymond Waits? I mean, why would you have a name on it if it's not a good name? That looks more like like a for a miniature cat to climb on. Mini tiny miniature cat climbing frame. That's what that is. Um, no, it's all necklace. And then that one random hand. I might keep that one random hand, actually. Maybe do a little bit of art with it, having coming out of a wall as like a coat hook thing. Don't know. But yeah, this is it's just a lot of these neck bits, really. That one's like a neck bit with earring bits on it. Yeah. Okay. Right. Oh lordy, I want to just look at the little boxes. Ooh, Crabtree and Evelyn, moisturising soap with shea butter. Thank you. Excellent. And then we've got, what's this? Bomboles de Cabo. Ooh, that's another nice soap as well. Um, yeah, I think uh, Kath Palmer wants a stand as well. So if you message me on Facebook and I'll sort you each out, like, um... A jewellery stand. Oh, that's a shame you're broken, John Richard. Can I fix you? No, you you just need a thing. I might fix you because John Richard is quite nice. That's got Swarovski in it. I'll keep you out. And I'll try and fix you. Notice how I talk to the jewellery as well. That's weird. They are total dust magnets, aren't they? You like you literally have to every time you use it, um, like sticky tape it up. Um, oh, some Crabtree and Evelyn um conditioner. Awesome. I'm even getting like you know my beauty products from here as well, and some Elizabeth Arden conditioner. That's cool. An unused Avon dark bronze pencil, but I wouldn't use that. That's a shame. Who? What's this? Shimmering bronze. I'm not a bronze kind of person. Any more makeup and stuff? Um, a new lifting eyeshadow. No, not my colour. A little mirror with a dog on it. Yep, still going, Kath. Um, so... Got black and white ones, and the white ones tend to have like um, like an earring thing at the front as well. So Catherine wants one, and so I've got two black ones. Yeah, two, ones, two white ones. There is a bracelet one, but I'm going to keep that one for myself, and a hand which I'm going to keep for myself as well. You are more than welcome, like to them. Um, so you want a black one? There you go. And then there's one for um, for Catherine as well. So some more Elizabeth Arden stuff there. Ooh, you're pretty. So nine two five clasp and some lovely glass, like um, sort of like mini fury sort of. But that's a lovely necklace there. Can you see? Isn't that super pretty? So that's staying. Um, a black one and a white one. Yep, sure. Just remind me on Facebook after because obviously I will just forget everything right now. The Holy Island of Linda's Farm soap. God, we're all right for cosmetics, that's for sure. Um, Constance Carol Blusher. Um, yes, Joan. Yeah, I think there's, then there's a white one left then. Yeah, definitely. It's yours then. I think that's all of them then. Unless anybody wants that Raymond Waits one. 
So that's a nice plastic turquoise necklace. Some faux pearl, vintage faux pearl. I'll keep you aside, but I can't be put. Um, six boxes, weighs 90 kilos approximately. Oh, hello, you're for me. Two little black cat brooch. It's like my kitty cats. That's mine. Oh, that's quite all right, Ashley. I mean, I'm gutted that you're still going, that's for sure. Um, are you silver? No. Right, I'm gonna try and get, things like this sell quite well, by the way. Like those chunky statement things. Uh, well, an Azumi and a Shizuma, see? Even though they hate each other, well, Azumi, Shizuma loves Azumi. Azumi not so keen on Shizuma. Because uh, Shizuma is like, playtime, playtime. And Azumi's like, fuck off. Come here, you. That's quite a nice necklace. Are you sterling? You're not sterling, but you're pretty. I'll keep you aside, just because that's quite a nice necklace. Um, yes, exactly. Shame them on Facebook, especially for keeping you waiting so long. That's just rude. Oh, there's some pretty earrings. I might put them into my turquoise and coral lock. So that's a nice colour at the top there. Um, more of that confetti loose sight there. Oh, right, what are you? Made in Poland, Avon Pro Brow Enhancer. Hmm. Right. Do I see anything of interest in there? Probably. Okay. Let me grab out of this. You look vintage, but you're not. Some more of that flat chain. I'll keep that out. Some vintage faux pearls. Some nice amber colour glass in there. Necklace, faux pearls, big chunky faux pearls. Just going straight back in there for now. What's that? You know my. Oh, that is that is kind of sucky. Oh, there's a mate to that fab earring I found earlier. So happy about that. I like that. Right, come on, come on. What are you? Oh, that's super sweet. Little row of houses made in ceramic. The phone's going, there's no way I'm answering the phone right now. Oh, uh, why do you have to be broken? You're pretty. That is such a shame. That is lovely glass there, vintage necklace. That is super pretty. Um, uh, Mummy brought me a coffee. Because she's a good egg like that. Right. Oh my god. Look at that. What are you made from? That is awesome, isn't it? That, oh, that's vintage. I don't know. Don't even know when. Is it on plastic? It's on plastic. Made from newspapers, I think, and then like crushed together. That's awesome. I love that. Oh, I know. I've totally missed sourcing, and then this is this is just like my. Oh. Don't mean so crude, but I'm wet right now. Oh, I hope I just made you all choke on your tea. <laughs> Morrison's. No, I'm not right for that one. Um, oh, yeah, have fun. Have fun. Equinox watch. You're a bonkers earring. Too hot outside. Never. Right, come on. Okay. 
anything there. Lots of things there, but oh my god, you'll never guess what I've just seen. Can you guess what I've just seen? That's oh, no worries. Thank you very much for joining. There's another Duran Duran badge. Yeah, you've got a proper little collection. Okay, I just saw a brooch where it is. Oh no. I always find these. They're weird, aren't they? It would be nice to find another nowl at the moment so that that other nowl doesn't feel all lonely. That would be good, wouldn't it? Aqua de Bulgari soap. Oh, that's quite nice. Got lots of lovely soap. Um, some Avon bronzer. Ooh, look at that beast. Jeebus. That's like half a kilo in itself. Oh, a little ring box. Why didn't you have a little ring in it? Hey, a little ring a ding ding. You're some nice beads. I like you. Do you stay? Yes. I very like you. That's lovely, isn't it? Look at them. Ethiopian trade beads. I don't know, but it's lush, isn't it? I very like that. That's cool. I'm trying to learn about trade beads and things and what the differences are and like the different places that they can come from and stuff. Because sometimes it's not enough to just go ethnic. Because people might call you up on it. That's cool. I'll test that for silver because that looks unusual. I know it's gorgeous, isn't it, Joan? Oh, I sold one of these the other week or something very similar with a little painted parrot on it. That's fun, but this is a new one. That's a shame. If it was a vintage one, I would have sold that one separate. Oh, we've got a new tagged Jaeger. That was probably a few quid, wasn't it? Um, oh, that's nice. Very 70s. It is 70s. It's exquisite. Little sun with some abalone in there. Excellent. Yeah, those trade beads are lush, aren't they? Oh, hello, hello. And we've got another one. Brilliant. Yay. So that one's more orangey and that one's more bluey. They're gorgeous, aren't they? Super lovely. Right, look at this hunker chunker monker, which unfortunately is a little bit frazzled. That's a shame because that is quite beast. I wonder if there's any rescuing that. That's a shame because that's ace. Really heavy stones there as well. Made in Italy. CB. CB. Hmm. Unusual, so I'll keep that out to look it up. But that's quite a weird looking one. So that's unusual enough for me. I like weird and unusual. Holy cow, right, you are a big old tanglage of stuff. Got some nice wooden beads there. They're cool, you can stay out. Some hearts. That's quite a nice southwestern style um, necklace. How did I forget the word necklace then? Dear God. <laughs> right, are you anything? You're missing bits, that's a shame. And then a smaller version of that big chunky one before that's made out of paper but I can't untangle this right now 
anything else. I'm just gonna pop these. Oh, look at that. That's crazy pink like this. These are going back in there for now. Right, we have got some more. Some aloe vera soap. We're all right for soaps. Lots more Crabtree and Evelyn conditioners. And a relaxing body wash. Crabtree and Evelyn's really nice as well. I'm happy with that. Some white stuff earrings. They'll go in a new tag slot. Bohemian Romance Flower Bracelet. Some more Crabtree and Evelyn conditioner. Any mud soap? Oh. No. I can't see. I think that. Oh. Aces. Sorry, no. But look at that ring. Love. That the metal thing on self is called a concho. Thank you. That is a fab ring. I will sell that separately on its own. That is ace. I love it. Right, we still haven't found that B yet, have we? We need to find a B. Care for the Wild International. We've got um, the old bob in there. That's cute. People like those. Oh, there's another one of those fab earrings. You can stay out. Now, I spy some watches. So, who are you? Oscar Emil? Never heard. Oh, lovely vintage crystal necklace there. Is it making rainbows? I think so. Pretty. Right. I'm just gonna, oh, and there's another one. Another lovely crystal necklace. I do like those crystal necklaces. I think they are super pretty. Oh, what we've got here. Come to Mama. Are you pretty? You are pretty. You're not on silver, but you're very pretty. Don't think that's silver anyway. But we've got little... Like watermelon glass dangly earrings. Super cute. I might test them anyway. Test them at their max. Just for a laugh. You're unusual. Um, Oscar Emil is QVC. Ah, right, okay. So maybe have a little bit of a following, but I really keep thinking like, oh, teach yourself about watches. Because there's good money in watches, but I don't know. That's a rather fabulous vintage necklace there. Very unusual colour as well. And we've got another crystal one. Which unfortunately is a bit busted, that's a shame. So that'll go into a vintage broken lot. Um, you're crazy. <laughs> You look vintage, come here you. Yes you are, but you're just a bit mashed up. Right, undo. Ah, you're broken. That's a shame. Maybe I can fix you though. No. Maybe. Right, that's a nice bracelet. It just needs proper fixing. But that could be quite cute. Isn't it? Oh, itchy, itchy. It's so hard trying not to scratch your face, isn't it? Some multi-tone stuff. Plastic, plastic. Got some faux pearl in here. Let go. Thank you. Oh, what are you? You're weird. You're modern, but you're quite nice. Very Art Deco in style. That's cute. Um, there we go. Thank you, Daryl. Right. Faux plastic pills. Um, nope. Yep. Yeah. 
Okay. Right, we're getting to some littles in a bit, I hope, and littles is always the, the funniest, for me anyway. Sorry, the Perkins earrings, um, Aurora Piano Cruises. I'll keep that out because that could be something unusual. Um, to say that I am happy with this lot is an understatement, by the way. Like, I am landed right now. Freaking landed. That's a nice vintage necklace. Oh! little carved stone dolphin that can go with my other weird shit dolphin <laughs> i'll send it to shelly that's bizarre that's quite 70s but i'm not sure what the hell it is um you're pretty loris is loris no loris isn't good is it Next, are you silver? You might be. Where's your... Yes, you are silver. See? I know silver. Let go. Let go. You want to let go. This is probably a made in Italy one. But we've got a little... Silver necklace with a little sparkly diamante dangle there. That's quite nice. We'll go over there. That's nice, but that's probably clothes accessories. Let's pop all these away. Um. Oh, I can't remember if Nia responded to the yes, she wants the. What's that? Not an ask? Oh! God, you're good. You're good, Cass. Yeah, didn't you say that she wanted that little doggy? Botanics. The pure power of plants. Strong and long. Chamomile. Nail. Varnish. Right. Chunky monkeys. <gasps> Yay! So we've got the other uh, shoe clip, that 80s one. Yes, the Dachshund. That's it. You did and you've messaged me. Or you've massaged me. Mm -hmm. Hello. Thank you. I'd quite like a nice massage. Um, Crabtree and Evelyn, Elizabeth Arden. Oh, lots of lovely cosmetics. It's great. Ooh. Awesome. Okay, does my eye go big if I do that? <laughs> That's cool. I like that. That can stay. Um, Jolie Rouge Velvet Lipstick. Unused. Clarins. That's quite a push, isn't it? Right, yes. So that's a pair of them. You must be right, yeah. Fab, thank you, Nia. Oh, we have got a little elephant candle. Cute. Another watch. Ingersoll. Now, I'm sure I have sold an Ingersoll before. Um, 17 jewels. Yeah, I think that might be a good watch. That I'll keep that aside. Um, you look okay, you look interesting. Just a nice bracelet, it's not silver, but it's just quite interesting. A bit brutalist looking, so I'll keep that aside. Right, nail varnish. A little marble swan thingy. I'm about to say Lamborn, then they're 40 to 50 pounds. Shut the front door. Well, these things, I can't see a makeup mark on them. 
I've had lambone um, cufflinks. <gasps> Holy shit. Lambone Birmingham. Thank you, store. I just need to find the other bastard one now, don't I? And there's me just tossing it aside. There's, I've got to find the other one now, haven't I? Are you going to stay with me while I try and find it? I do that? Why did I just toss them as if like everything is shit when it's not? Okay, I might just have to come back to that. Are you shitting me though? Seriously? Like, oh, I'm on um, box four. <laughs> And um, Stahl has just told me that a pair of these is like 40 50 pound and I've tossed one of them in this box with no hope of ever finding it. <laughs> it is in here somewhere. It's just because it's brown. It's very hard to see. I will find it though. Put it in here, didn't I? Right, do you know what? I'm going to keep that aside. Okay. Exactly. It's not like it's not like it's going anywhere, you know. So it's it'll still be there. Right. Okay. So what have we got here? A pile of vintage stuff. That's nice. With a tiny little clasp. Super cute. Uh, you say money, but you're broken, but that'll go into a vintage broken lot. That's some nice glass, but it's all rusted, but that lovely peachy glass colour. So that can go in a vintage lot. It'll just need cleaning up, but that's nice. Some evil eye things. As me, you in the way. Shall we, shall we dress you up? Look, Azumi in pearls. Dripping with pearls, darling. Dripping with pearls. Come here. Azumi in pearls. Azumi in glass. Yeah? Can we put you in this one? Oh, Azumi, you're so beautiful. She's like, yeah, fuck off. Um, start on another box so I don't bury it further. That's probably a good idea. I'll, but there's only like these tiny bits in here, so I'll I'll empty this out in a bit when Azumi gets out of the way and put them back in this bag. That's what I will do. That's nice. You look vintage and very well made. Not signed, but that's pretty. Don't put any more in the box. Okay, I won't. Azumi, you're being very insistent now, aren't you? You're determined, aren't you? Okay. See, I threw them over there. I'm going to throw these over there. Azumi, I love you. Say hello. And now go away. Okay, we'll look at these little bits. Um, oh, tiny little baby bangle thingy, earrings, what's the pin? 
UNICEF rights respecting school. That's a nice vintage earring. Look at that, that's fun. And some more for my turquoise lot. You're a nice earring too. You want to be silver, I'm going to put you on my testing thing. Right, that's all of them. Little bits, little bits, I love little bits. You photographed 15 jewellery lots. Well done, Sam. Nice work. I hope I'm inspiring you. Okay. Another little watch, but that's not really. Okay. These bangles, I've once nearly um, thrown a load out and then tested and they ended up being silver and marked silver. So that's got potential. So that will go on my to test pile. Okay, right. So as you can, can you see in there, little bits. I might just. There we go. Right. Is that better? And then I can put them straight back in here here we go right so we have got um a little crystal bangle which i'll probably put in the window um mediterranean little pin that's probably from a cruise um stratton something that'll go in a it's locked. We've got another now. It's a now. Um, Yorkshire Air Ambulance. I'll keep that for me, ma'am. Yorkshire. Oh, another one of them. They look like, you know, like a fairy's pin, you know, that you collect. Oh, that's a nice vintage. Probably 70s ring. Keep that out. You get these in every lot as well. Um, hope you don't miss any gold. I hope I don't miss any gold as well. Um, some little wooden blocks. Thing, a cufflink that says sexy. Yes. Ooh, right. Possibly silver, possibly just stainless steel. You have a feel of silver, a tarnish of silver. With some nice... Yes, you are silver. I see hallmarks. Yay. So we've got a nice little silver and some kind of polished stone bracelet, which um, is very, very tarnished and very dark. But I'll give that a nice clean up. I wonder if you're silver. No, I don't think so. Uh, we've got some more cufflinks. Oh, bald and sexy is that? No, no, that's not staying at all. That's hideous. Um, nope, nothing there. That's a cool, interesting earring, and I'm hoping that that's got a friend. Oh, yes, it does. So they're cool, quite brutalist style. I like them. We have got a little 70s stainless steel and amethyst pendant. <laughs> I know, right? Well, you know, 90s clothes back in fashion. I'm like, I still got my clothes from the 90s. I haven't had to buy new ones. <laughs> there you are, Mrs. Oh, have you put it up? You want to have a look? Um, not quite now. I will in a bit, though. Because I'm still alive with these lot. Oh, that's nice. So that's nice, and it's got a little. Um, can't remember what they. I know it's a pendant, but when it, it's a, it's a. They begin with an E. Can't remember. To make it more interesting, that's kind of what I want to say. Oh, that's another nice vintage ring there. That's quite cute. Okay, let's get rid of the definite knots, shall we? Like 
the broken bits and the... Oh, there's the other paper clip thing. I think I probably threw that away. I want to find you guys some more gold. Can you saw there? Nope. I definitely want to find the other citrine earring because that is beautiful. And we've got another little bone pin there. That's quite nice. You might be, no you're not. Are you? Hmm, no, I don't think so. Your phone, nice amber beads. Oh, a little handmade enamel pin there. Little, little, little. Come here, you little gold back, because you are stamped. And we'll take a look at you in a minute. Always check gold earring backs. Okay? No, you're not. Because sometimes they are gold. Like actual gold. So... I'm going to use. Does that work? Okay, it says something on it. I can't see what. Okay, I think I can't read what's on it, but I reckon that's gold. So I reckon we've got gold earring back there that's probably only like a quid's worth if that but still it go it'll go in the uh in the scraps and it all mounts up we've got some vintage cufflinks here somewhere yep a little pair of cufflinks camera went funny oh sorry it might be getting overheated because it's proper. I wonder if I should maybe put something behind. Oh God, I've been sat down a long time. That hurts. Oops. Somehow block out some sun. I don't know. I don't know if that did anything. Oh God. I'm beginning to ache. Yowza. Right. I reckon that's that box probably done. I'll have to come back again to it. Oh, there's another one. I can see that says a mark on it. The earring isn't. The earring is just gold plated but the back says 375 so a tiny little bit of gold again about 50 pence worth if that I think that's it Wait, there's another one. And I think that says 375 as well. Tiny little bits of gold. I don't think I can see any more. I do like that earring. Right, that's Littles. Oof. Don't know about you guys, but I'm getting knackered now. 
Oh. Oh, have you not have you not managed to get through to them yet? That is total works, isn't it? Right. Come on now, I need to find a small brown thing. Or have you disappeared into actual thin air? Here we go. So how much did you save for them? That's pretty awesome. Right, what's the time now? It's three o'clock. I hope you don't mind guys, but I'm gonna take a little bit of a break. Because I'm a little bit achy right now and I need a wee and a cigarette and stuff and my hands are all sweaty in these gloves. I have got two more boxes left to do. So um, what day is it today? This day. Is anyone on tonight? Is anyone? I know ads. Oh sorry am I? Yeah, it might be like my phone overheating and stuff. So, yeah. I'm going to come back later with the other two boxes, have a tidy up of all of this and stuff. Is that cool? Yeah, I don't know what time, but yeah, I'll come back tonight and show you the rest. Okay? So, thanks very much for joining me, guys. Um, I hope you've enjoyed. Um, yeah, to the people that wanted some stuff, I'm sure you've messaged me already. I'll sort you those things out. Cool. All right. I'll catch you in a bit. See you later. Bye-bye.